And because they happen to have this book, I figured I might as well read the poem that this book is named after in this book, which is called Slate and Marrow. No one understood. It was like every morning I couldn't find a reason to wake up. The world felt cold, like slate, like the marble tiles in the front hallway of my parents' house. The floor was always cold. Oh, I wish I could feel that cold against my feet now. But there I was in some 11 by 12 apartment room, running from my past, running from my present. Every morning I would wake up, and I would wake up from that night again, when he came uninvited, or did I invite him? The haze of the drunken nights from then on, wearing the dress, knowing the faceless faces couldn't care less as long as they knew they could have their way with me that night. What would my parents think of me now? I'm no longer their little girl. I could feel myself getting older by the minute. I could feel my skin wrinkling, my, my joints getting stiff. I could feel my bones, the marrow drying up, my bones crumbling away. And every morning I would still put on my clothes, get my work together, head out the door. Could I ever get out of this cycle? And it was as if I had never realized that all this time I was looking for a reason. And it was you. When I strolled up to the street singer, I stopped because I saw your face. Why on earth did you think you could tell me your secrets only after we met 15 minutes before? And just being in your presence made me want to break down, made me hate everything, made me love everything, made me want change. I'd hit you in rage, I'd lean on you, my slight, and you let me. And it was if the marrow was back. I could just lay in bed at night and feel the blood running through my body. I could feel the oxygen as I inhaled, hitting my bloodstream. I could even feel the marrow, all the cells in my body moving faster and faster. My skin would tingle. I suddenly had power. I could make blood move to any part of my body. I could make the pain go away. I could turn myself into stone, not so I was cold and unfeeling, but so I was strong, immovable. And I did it for me, but don't you dare think for a minute that I didn't do it for you. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you. know I will leave business cards here or you can check it out on the PDF file and thank you Dan thank you everyone thank you all thank you guys so much.